What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video on my terrific channel. Who wore it better? Have you guys ever seen maybe one of your students, maybe one of your friends? Heck, maybe it was just some random person on the street and you look at them and you just think, man, like, I swear, I've seen that outfit somewhere. If that's the case for any of you, then you're in luck today, okay? Because we're gonna be taking a look at some of the top who wore it better pictures. All right, first one here, we got... <laughs> We got a highlighter, pink highlighter. You don't see those every day. And then you got your teacher over there on the chalkboard. She's writing something. Well, guys, seriously, who wore it better? Highlighter or the teacher? Let's just keep this between you and I. I'm uh, I'm going going with the highlighter on this one. This woman or Homer Simpson. All right, what do we got here? Oh, jeez. I, uh, mm, okay. Uh, let's just uh, let's keep it PG, guys. Keep it PG. Girl definitely wore it better, though. Just side note. No! Heidi Klum or a car wash brush? I can't believe this is an actual dress. Is this, wait, is this an actual dress? Or guys, is this Photoshop? Honestly, like, please let me know. There is in no way in heck that Heidi Klum wore a freaking car wash brush to the red carpet. Okay, honestly, like, is, is, that, a, is that her real dress or is it Photoshopped? But on a more serious note, um, Heidi, if, if this really was the dress that you wore, uh, you're rocking it way better than that, you know, that clean old car wash brush. I wonder if she like spun around and like did some twirls, you know, with some wet soap and water, if that would actually like, you know, clean a car. Anybody want to make some side money? Okay, there you go. There's your gig. Grandma or the carpet? Dang, well, <laughs> grandma would have a dress with this exact freaking flower plant design. Dude, like this wreathe uh, leaf plant design is like so old. Like even, I think my grandparents and you know, like uh, great great grandparents probably had like carpeting or wallpaper or whatever, gift wrapped with that kind of design. That's how you know it's an old design. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with old people, grandma but i have to apologize because i think the floor uh just i think the floor takes the cake on this one yo am i being too mean <laughs> yo what do you guys think okay like it's okay you don't have to worry about hurting the floor's feelings or grandma's you know i'm sure they don't mind she's passed out okay she can't even hear you justin bieber or this baby that's jb J justin my dude what what are you doing this is just one of the most uncomfortable photos I've ever seen. Like, it it legit looks like he's wearing a big old saggy diaper. Full of crap, mind you. Like, dude, look at that sag. Uh, what are these, harem pants? I know these got, you know, pretty popular over the last couple of years, you know, especially with people like Psy wearing them. But personally, I, I was never feeling it. I never thought that these pants in any way remotely looked uh, fashionable, let alone complimented the human body. On a baby, okay, understandable. Babies poop and pee, you know, they, they literally soil themselves in their pants. But come on, like, it, on normal grown-up people, celebrities included Justin Bieber, it just, that just, that looks wrong, okay? I'm not, you sit down next to me, I'm sorry. Justin Bieber, I don't care, I'm not sitting next to you, you sit down with me wearing those pants. Donald Trump or this ear of corn and you gotta admit, that ear of corn sure wears that hair, you know, pretty well. I, better than Donald Trump, you know, our president, commander in chief, uh, hard to say. This one, mm, I'm gonna, dude, I'm gonna, have to go, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to go with a tie on this one. What do you guys think? Well, you know, honestly, now that I look at it more, you know, like, Donald Trump, he looks a little bit stressed out in that picture, you know, but the ear of corn is playing it off a little bit cooler, you know, a little more calm, cool, and collect. The corn's, like, even got a little lean going on, leaning over to the side. Very cool, very hip. I think I'm actually gonna have to give this one to the ear of corn. Lil Wayne or E.T. And, wait, uh... Guys, which, which one is E.T.? Which one's Lil Wayne? That was a joke. Calm thyself. I'm just kidding, guys. Everyone knows E.T. is on the left. Lil Wayne's on the right. Okay, obviously, how can you not be able to distinguish one of the greatest, most successful rappers of the last generations? Seriously, though, when did uh, when did E.T. get all these tattoos? Yo, was that in the movie? I did not remember that. Ivanka Trump or this burrito? You gotta admit, the burrito, mmm. That it's looking pretty good, and let me just say, okay, I, I'm I'm not even that hungry, but that burrito, mm, it's calling me. Where's my burrito? Where's my burrito? No! Do you guys like burritos? One thing I do miss about living here in Seoul is, uh, you know, having a good old Chipotle. Oh man, what I wouldn't give to have some Chipotle right now. Okay, am I the only one? All right, sorry. Back to the picture. Uh, yo, my girl Ivanka, she's rocking that tinfoil dress. Like, you know, if she's uh worried about, you know, aliens or electric magnetic radiation, yo, she is covered. Like, I mean, like literally covered in tinfoil. But uh, honestly, uh, you know what? I guess I will give it to Ivanka on this one because, you know, she just rocks that dress so well. The burrito 
Nintendo, on the other hand, you know, I mean, they could use a little bit of help, you know, make, t toning it down with the tinfoil, you know, I can barely see his face. I think it needs to show a little bit more skin, you know what I mean? I don't know, that's just me. What do you guys think about this one? Lady Gaga or this patio heater? Again, guys, I'm... <laughs> A little confused here. Which one's Lady Gaga? Which one's the patio heater? Why do they have to pick photos where the people and the objects wear them so similar? Like it's to a point where I actually can't tell which one's which. Wait a minute. I think I'm pretty sure this one's Lady Gaga, okay? Because everybody knows that patio heaters do not have handbags. At least as far as I know. I, I mean, I mean, like I never had one, but who knows? This one's a <laughs> this one's a tough choice. First of all, my girl, Lady Gaga. Let me just ask you: Can you can you see out of that thing? Like seriously, you need a bodyguard or like a guard dog to walk with you so you know where you're going. Because dude, how do you see? It literally looks like she has a spaceship on her head. Am I the only one seeing that? I'm sorry. Like, no offense. Your outfit, your this getup is gold. Well, I mean. Technically, it's black, but you know what I mean. That's a bomb ass outfit, okay? That's the best patio heater outfit I've I've ever seen, okay? Like, if they had that outfit, you know, on Halloween at Party City, heck yeah, dude, I'm going as a patio heater. But uh, who wore it better? Hmm, that's uh, that's 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 hard to say. I feel like Lady Gaga's is good and all, but you know, the patio heater, I think it just wins on this one. But hey, that's just me. Let me know what you guys think. This man sucks or the airport's floor? Wow, I. I am very impressed that this dude actually got socks with the exact same design as the airport floor. How is that even possible? Like, where did he go to get this exact design? Where did the airport go to get that floor carpet? Like, did they just happen to, you know, go down to the same, you know, carpet distributor and, and, and sock outlet? And that place just happens to make the exact same design? Or heck, dude, maybe I'm missing out. Is this like a really famous popular design for, for socks as well as floor carpet? Somebody please let me know, okay? I don't want to be missing out on all the cool stuff these days. But, uh, yeah, as far as who wore it better, hmm. I'm gonna go with the dude on this one, okay? Because I like how his uh, socks are a little bit brighter, a little bit more catchy, you know, grabs your attention ever so slightly more than the uh, floor carpet. The question about which one is cleaner, uh, the dude's socks or the floor carpet, oh, that that's a, that's, a, that's a whole nother question. Kim Kardashian or this onion bag? Well, I just gotta say, yo, Kim, my girl, looking a little thick in this picture, but, uh, you know, still looking good. The, uh, the onion bag, on the other hand, I don't know, like, uh, obviously, like, I can see a couple of onions in there, but uh, I feel like the bag is just a little too tight around the onions you know like uh, I feel like it's just kind of suffocating them you know which which obviously isn't good for for healthy onions so I'm gonna have to go with uh, Kim Kardashian on this one yo she definitely rocks the onion bag way better than the onion Justin Timberlake or these ramen noodles damn yo guys hello have you ever heard of <laughs> you got ramen noodle hair insult you ever heard that this is literally the embodiment of that by the way no offense to anybody that does have ramen noodle hair I do apologize we are not laughing at you okay Okay, we're laughing with you. I'm gonna have to go with JT on this one because, dude, he's he's rocking that ramen noodle hair like no other. Real question though is, uh, you know, like which one tastes better? Not that I'm gonna taste any of them, but I'm just saying. That ramen noodle hair looks legit. Oh, geez, and speaking of food, Justin Bieber or a panini? Wow, I mean, as much as, you know, Justin uh, is is rocking that uh, that sweater uh, or whatever, what is that supposed to be, fur? I think I'm gonna have to go with the panini on this one because the panini just looks ever so scrumptious. JB, on the other hand, dude, like I get it, you know, you look similar to a panini but everybody knows that's probably like fur and I'm strictly against fur eating animals to, to survive yeah that's one thing but then like eating them murdering them slaughtering them just so you can wear their skin that I'm, I'm not really for that you know it's just me sorry plus I mean like look at that face he's making in the picture here he clearly doesn't want us to vote for him Nicki Minaj or He-Man <laughs> dude is that even a joke He-Man all the way obviously you can't mess with He-Man <laughs> A high fashion model or this homeless guy. Once I figure out which one's the fashion model and which one's the homeless guy, you know, I can I can give you guys my answer properly. But uh, I must say, yo, this uh, this guy over here, he he is rocking that look. I think he's the model. Just look at that look at that model walk. You know, that model look expression in his face. Yeah, I think he definitely rocks this better. Okay, so I'm gonna have to give it to the high class fashion model. Sorry, garbage man. This model or a duster, it, guys. Like seriously, I I don't understand sometimes where you know the the fashion designers get their ideas from. Like I get it, fashion is all about being crazy, being new, being experimental, being expressive, but sometimes it's just, no, like, no, just, 
no. No. All right, guys, I think that's all we're gonna do today. If you guys wanna check out more of these funny Who Wore It Better pictures, I'll leave the original link down below. By the way, guys, we do have some amazing Calm Thyself merchandise. There's a link to that down below. If you guys are already repping the merch or you're gonna go buy some, feel free to tweet a picture of you wearing it at me and I'll be sure to give it a retweet so everybody in the Toast Army can see that you are awesome. Also, new merch is coming very soon. I'm not exactly sure, you know, like when uh, or how exactly it's gonna turn out, but I'll keep you guys updated. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know down below in the comments what you guys thought of some of these Who Wore It Better photos. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Good night.